Hi all, this is Tyler Zito, a partner solution engineer with VMware Carbon Black. Today I'm going to do a quick overview of the Carbon Black Cloud audit and remediation tool. This is going to be a real-time device assessment and remediation solution included within the Carbon Black Cloud suite. So this is a tool that's going to provide additional context as well as visibility via the use of running queries to give you additional insight across the machines within your environment. If you have it enabled within your user interface, um, you're going to see it enabled under the Live Query tab on the left. If we drop in a new query, what we're going to see is we're going to have a list of recommended queries. Now, these are going to be pre-configured queries out of the box. We're going to have 95 of them all together, highlighting the four verticals here. That'd be in IT hygiene, vulnerability management, threat hunting, and compliance. So this is a great way to go in and get insight across machines if you're running an engagement or before we start configuring and customizing policies. So for example, if we wanted to get insight into anything compliance related, um, the ones that we already have configured here, for example, if we're trying to see what type of device encryption we have enabled across Windows machines. So in this case, it will be BitLocker configuration details. We're going to be able to schedule this query out to run at the frequency of your choosing, if you need it daily, weekly, monthly, specify the time, and you can even email out the results upon completion. So if you wanna keep a log of all these reports as they get completed, you can send that over to a specified mailbox. Now, another neat thing within this tool is that if you hit this plus sign on the bottom left-hand side, we're gonna be able to see the actual query that was run here. We can also go over to Edit SQL, if you want to add anything in or out of the queries that we already have configured. Another thing we're going to have within SQL Query is since this is an open text box, you can run your own queries if you are familiar with SQL. We do have some links regarding OS queries, so intro to SQL and everything you need to know to better understand it, as well as a link to the tables or the OS Query Schema, which is what these queries are going to be pulling from. So there will be 263 at your disposal that you can leverage in building out the queries within the Carbon Black Cloud. Now we can specify how we wanna run these. So if you wanna run queries against all endpoints by default, that's what's gonna happen. However, you can select a specific policy that you create or specified endpoints that we wanna run these across. So here we can see I have my personal computer and maybe one of my VMs. I can choose just to run it across those because they're Windows and specify any Windows related queries that I want to pull back information on. Or if you want to go ahead and run your own query to get an idea of, for example, what kind of programs are going to be running across our machines. Maybe this will give you insight into any known interop issues you've had in the past, but it does give you a good idea of anything you may need to be aware of before deploying or enforcing policies across these machines. So we can go ahead and run that query. And if we drop down to our query results, we're gonna go ahead and see which queries are run. We're gonna see how many devices it's reached out to and how many have responded. You're also gonna get the status over here on the right-hand side. You can choose to stop the query, rerun them, duplicate them, or delete them from the list view. As you shift over to the right-hand side here, we can see what schedule queries we have in place. So if you choose to schedule anything, maybe you're looking at specified Windows patches or any of the CPU related information, and you want to have that run on a weekly basis, you would see that listed here. But if we want to pull back and see what programs am I running across the machines within my environment, I can drop down into that. I'm going to see which machines match that response so I can see which device responded to it, which was my home computer. This was 11 minutes ago, ID number, install date, location, source, and so on. So if there's any pressing information in here I need to be aware of or anything I maybe want to approve ahead of time, in my case, there's specific applications on my home PC like gaming services um, that may cause interop issues. It's something to be aware of so I can go ahead and write approvals for that ahead of time. This is a great tool to add additional context beyond what you'd be provided with our NGAV and EDR tool alone, something we See vastly leveraged by our partners uh, within the community. 
Thank you. And that was the overview of audit intermediation within the Carbon Black Cloud.